guys um, today we're gonna install this American flag decal on this 2014 um, Jeep Wrangler so this one it will work on a 2011 through 2017 Jeep Wrangler uh, back window on the hardtop um, we all this will come in two so you get one flag for each side one of them is gonna be reversed so on both sides they will look exactly the same I have an example right here um, so one will be with stars um, on the left and the one with stars on the right so but this one it's another one that we have available for uh, for sale um, so if you don't like this kind of distressed look you can uh, just order a simple one like that um, there will be links down below in the description um, so and this we're doing a matte black today but we have many other colors available for those that have a 2007 um, through 2010 Jeep Wranglers um, the window will be slightly smaller um, I think it's just a little bit shorter so for those we have just a square flag that can be installed and then the edges can be just uh, trimmed with a blade we're gonna have a video on this too it will probably be in the description below so if this is what you're interested in um, you can see in the description below and we'll have this in many other uh, sizes so it will pretty much work for any car you just have to choose your size but today we're just gonna install this I'm gonna show you how to do it it's pretty easy you just have to take the proper steps so first what you're gonna want to do is uh, clean the window pretty good um, I'm just gonna use some cleaning alcohol just gonna spray it on there and microfiber towel I'm just gonna wipe any dust or dirt off because we want this decal to apply nice and flat and make sure you get the on the edges on the inside all around okay now I'm gonna take my masking tape and uh, I'm gonna place the decal onto the window it's just gonna take a piece of the masking tape and just to hold it in place it doesn't have to be perfect yet just do it this uh, just do this on all four sides actually let's do this on six sides because we're still gonna need this thing later so just like that now we want to make sure it's perfectly in place we want the decal to cover the window on all sides so uh, we're just gonna loosen the tape a little and we're gonna move it around now um, just take your time and make sure just move it up down right left and just play around with it until you get it perfectly in place where you need it to be
I would suggest doing this um, early morning or in the evening uh, just because it's it's kind of hard when it's too hot out um, but it's still doable and I mean if you have to do it in the sun that's fine but um, it's actually no big deal so I, I, I've been doing this in direct sun all the time and I had no problems but it's recommended to do it um, out of the sun so it's up to you so it's pretty much in place where it should be there let me show you close up and I forgot to mention this one is uh, a perfect fit flag so um, there's no trimming necessary it's just you just apply it and you're good to go so um, let's see now what we want to do is uh, apply two strips of tape right in the center but make sure it will hold it in place one and overlapping a little bit on the first one we have a two that's two okay that looks good just take one more or two more pieces there and right there just to make sure it doesn't move and doesn't okay now remove um, all the tape on one side now we're gonna need scissors so we're gonna remove the backing paper just like that you can lay the decal against the window and kind of roll roll off the backing paper this way you will uh, ensure that the decal will stay onto the transfer tape see right there the star um, it stayed with the backing paper that's because I was going too fast so you have to do it pretty slow and you have to watch watch what's happening so I'm gonna fix it real quick there we go now do it slowly because uh, you might mess this up and that's not gonna be good there we go now just cut off the paper off just make sure you're cutting off just the back paper do not cut this just the back paper just like this slide it off let it drop okay now you're gonna take your squeegee um, this will come with the decals so if you order decals squeegee will come with it so um, take the smooth side uh, of the squeegee now don't apply the decal you just hold it up in the air and uh, on this side start going in up and down motion with the squeegee up and down up and down and slowly move uh, forward about half an inch at a time so um, you can even do it slower it's only gonna make it better so um, but make sure you apply some pressure with the squeegee when you're going with it just when you just when you just start when you're starting off just kind of soft and then just uh, apply some good pressure and this will eliminate any bubbles or, or uh, wrinkles or anything like that so um let's see i'm gonna start super slow just up 
and down but keep holding the decal itself keep holding it in the air and slowly slowly applying it so don't just apply it and then squeeze you out it's gonna be a mess <coughs> excuse me so just up down up down up down you eventually well you probably will have some bubbles uh, here and there um, if they're tiny they're gonna be gone within like a week of the car being in the sun and uh, if they're pretty big you can just take a blade punch a, puncture a little hole in it and just squeegee it out with the soft side because uh, um, once we remove the transfer tape the decal is going to be naked so uh, if you use this side on the vinyl you will scratch it so that's what this soft side is for I'll show you later if we have a couple bubbles but I hope we won't okay let's continue up down up down When you get to the end, keep your keep your fingers under there. Don't let it fall yet, cause uh, it will just it's not gonna be good. So keep it on under there until the very end. And when you're like half inch from it, just let it go. Okay, now um, I'm just gonna squeeze it out a little better. Apply some pressure. You can do it with two hands if you want. There we go. Now, at this point, you can remove all the tape. So, all of it and this one also. There we go. Now, just repeat the same thing with the other side. Just nice and slow. Remove the backing. And while you're pulling it off, make sure the decals stay in place. Make sure nothing, see, just right here. You can just, if this happens, this usually doesn't happen, it's probably too hot. But if this does, just push it back in there and it should stick. There we go. now just repeat the same thing with this side so just hold it up in the air and slowly up and down up and down Okay, we're done. Now, do not remove the uh, tape from the top before um, you tuck the ends. So, if there is some decals that go over the um, end of the windows, all you have to do is take your squeegee and kind of work around it. Just like that. On all sides. Do this on all sides, right there. There we go. Now we're completely done and we're ready to remove the tape. Um, 
So just start from one end, from one uh, corner, I guess. Now, do not pull the tape. Just do not rip it off towards you. Um, keep it uh, against the window and just slowly kind of roll it. Well, pull slightly and just again keep it closer to the window and just pull on it slowly again one when you're pulling it off um, keep an eye on the decals because uh, sometimes they might want to stay with the tape and you might rip the decal just watch it and do it slowly I mean it's it's super easy actually but you just have to keep an eye on it there we go now all the sides that did not stick take the side soft side of your squeegee and just go over it um, they should all stick right there perfect so it's there's some bubbles you can try but again all of these little bubbles uh, what's gonna happen is the Sun is gonna heat um, the window the vinyl and the vinyl will shrink and push out every uh, bubble that's uh, in there so uh, small bubbles they'll be gone if it's kind of like a big bubble which wouldn't have any of those right here but I'll show you an example on a little one I don't know if the ca camera will catch it but there's a small bubble right there all you have to do is take like a needle or a blade poke a little hole in it and soft side of the squeegee just kind of and it's gone but don't poke a big of a hole just uh, a tiny hole that will let the air come out and it's all gonna be gone okay so uh, don't be scared if you have bubbles on there that's not a big problem they're gonna be gone so uh, just have to wait a little but uh, yeah that's pretty much it that's how it's done um, I'll show you how it looks I'm gonna show you how it looks from a uh, distance well there you have it um, it it would take me about five minutes to do each side um, probably take you ten minutes for each side it's pretty easy you just have to take the proper steps and uh, so uh, if you like this uh, there is gonna be a link in the description below um, and uh, I'm also gonna include a couple links to different flags that we have and so uh, yeah that's it Thanks for watching. Bye.